Hello everyone and welcome back to the match here on WWE 2K19. We'll be saying that for a long time still to come as 2K22 delayed by about six months. So uh, we'll be sticking with this until March next year by the looks of it. Hopefully they keep the servers open that time. Uh, that would be a big hope. Uh, but today we have got for you, uh, continuing on with the beautiful Bobby Eaton tribute this week, we have got the Rock and Roll, and we haven't got the Rock and Roll, we've got the Midnight Express, of course, beautiful Bobby Eaton there, um, alongside Dennis Condroy, going up against the team of the Fantastics. This is Tommy Rogers, and this is Bobby Fulton. Which one's which? I don't know either, but I'm going to find out for you. Right, it looks like Tommy Rogers is the one with the darker hair, and Bobby Fulton is the one with the blonde hair. Um, there's no picture of Bobby Fulton, so I'm going to go for that anyway. Okay, let's go. Boom, here we go. So we are underway. We've got Dennis Condroy then in the uh, the pink and purple trunks and knee pads. We've got beautiful Bobby Eaton in the all silver trunks, or tight, shall I say, with the, uh, the stripes down the side. And then we got uh, Fulton and Rogers, the Fantastics, in the matching blue and white attires. Um, let me have a quick gander. It looks like that's correct. Yeah, it looks like that's correct to me. So it looks like Tommy Rogers is the darker haired one on the right hand side, currently facing off against Bobby Eaton. Whereas Bobby Fulton is the one with the longer blonde hair, who's currently getting it in the knee from Dennis Condry. Uh, Dennis Condry, he needs to prove himself here because, of course, we've seen the Midnight Express already wrestle once this week against Bill Watts and the Junkyard Dog, and it was Dennis who um, was pinned in that match and lost it for the Midnight Express, who, of course, will be getting an opportunity at the Tag Team Championships this weekend. And they need to build up that momentum. They really do, of course. It's down to, I suppose, um, Bobby Eaton and the leader or the manager of the Rock and Roll Express, oh, I keep saying Rock and Roll Express, the manager of the Midnight Express, Mr. Uh, Jim Cornette, to decide who he puts forward for that match, and I think at this point, maybe Stan Lane might be a better option. But we'll have to wait and see how that pans out as the referee comes down to count. It's not even a one count. Nice takedown by... Um, Tommy Rogers on the inside of the ring on Bobby Eaton. Beautiful Bobby Eaton. Of course, you've got Bobby Fulton on the outside with Dennis Condry. The Fantastics versus the Midnight Express. The uh, the debut of the Fantastics. Midnight Express very low in the rankings. They'll be hoping for a lot better moving forward. Does there remember a phase called Phase Simp? Really? <laughs> Who would have known there was a member of Phase called Phase Simp? That's mad. Right, Tommy Rogers now twisting the head of um, Bobby Eaton. Dennis Condroy in control of Bobby Fulton on the outside. I'm getting confused. All these names. Too many names. Nice backbreaker by beautiful Bobby Eaton. They need this win, the Midnight Express. They need to build up momentum moving forward into that tag team championship match. It's a triple threat elimination as well. Not going to be easy. Of course, you've got the champions, the Von Eriks. Um, I know that doesn't really narrow it down too much because there's a lot of Von Eriks, but those are the, the current day Von Eriks, Marshall and... Oh, what's his name? Marshall and somebody. The ones from MLW. Um, they're our current champions. They won it back at MLW Battle Riot. And, of course, we've got two-man power trip also going for the championship. They're the number one contenders. Uh, the team of Triple H and Stone Cold Steve Austin. Bobby Eaton now. Big knee right in the face of Tommy Rogers. Then a big knee once again in the face. It's Bobby Fulton who is in control though, of Dennis Condry at this point in time. And... Uh, I do feel like Dennis might be holding the Midnight Express back so far this week. Nothing against him, I just don't feel like he's really doing as much as they would want him to do. Condry now taking down Bobby Fulton. As you see Bobby Eaton now, look at that match in there. Both going for the knee on the inside, the leg of the Fantastics. But uh, it is a fight back there from Tommy Rogers. Tommy Rogers sounds so dodgy. Tommy Rogers sounds like the leader of some sort of uh, racist hate group. <laughs> I'm Tommy Rogers. Get out of my country. 
<laughs> he does a bit, doesn't he? Oh, I'm Tommy Rogers. Tommy Rogers is just, it's just a bit of a dodgy name. I don't know why. Sorry if your name is Tommy Rogers, by the way. <laughs> I do apologise, but... Um, well, me taking the mickey out of him seems to have done him pretty well there. No, that's uh, Bobby Fulton there with a the DDT looking for the pin. Bobby Eaton has to come across and save his tag team partner. It's Bobby Fulton versus Bobby Eaton. Now this is going to be a real mess of my brain. Fulton sending Eaton off the ropes and into a nice big hip toss. Uh, Midnight Express, we'll see them again wrestle tomorrow where Bobby Eaton will be teaming with Sweet Stan Lane to take on the Road Warriors, which I'm looking forward to. Another pin, but this time it's Dennis Condre having to save Bobby Eaton. Bobby Fulton now bringing Condry back up to a standing base, now dumping him over the top. He holds on, and it looks like a Bobby Fulton's actually busted open. Rocking that crimson mask. As it looks now, now Tommy Rogers, Tommy Rogers, on the outside of a Bobby Eaton, as Dennis Condroy here trying to prove himself has... Bobby Fulton, oh, had him under control, slammed him down with a... I've got a front flatliner, a stroke, if you will. And it was broken up, though. Bobby Eaton unable to protect his tag team partner, but the damage has been done. Midnight Express taking control of the ring now. Bobby Eaton on the outside looking to go after Bobby Fulton. All four men on the outside of the ring now. Nice Russian leg sweep there by Dennis Condry. And firm control now for Midnight Express on the outside. It's a shame we can't use managers in tornado matches because... It would have been really good to have um, the likes of Jim Cornette at ringside for these matches, but that's the issue with this uh, with this game, with the Tornado and the non-manager. Hopefully it'll be one of the things they do fix for 2K22. I mean, they've got enough time to do it now, hopefully. Dennis Condroy slamming Tommy Rogers face first into the mat. Tommy, the big uppercut on Dennis Condroy. Um, now in with a boot in the gut, and he has control of the arm into that hammerlock, but he gets an elbow right in his face. It does leave you very open, that hammerlock, because you're using both of your arms to contain one of their arms, so it doesn't necessarily make you look that good, to be honest. Because really, you're, um, you're completely leaving yourself wide open for that other arm to be used. The Fantastics here, both heading up on the top. What are these two guys looking for? There's a lovely drop kick by Bobby Fulton. And another lovely drop kick by Tommy Rogers. Wow. What a team synergy there by the Fantastics who are looking fantastic. And now both locking in the submissions. Oh my god, look at that. Condry's in trouble. I think Bobby Eaton just saved him in time there. Just in time. Tommy Rogers now in with a Russian leg sweep as beautiful Bobby Eaton in with that gut buster, not gut buster, gut wrench suplex, should I say. And Bobby Fulton is really busted open and he takes a knee right in their head. It's going to make that even worse. Pin now on Dennis Condry by Tommy Rogers. And he was oh, just about broken up by beautiful Bobby Eaton who then takes a blow right in the back of their head by Tommy Rogers. Can you imagine a match between Tommy Rogers and Tito Santana? <laughs> That'd be a mess, that would. It? <laughs> As Bobby Fulton now has the legs hooked once again into that figure four leg lock on Dennis Condry. If he taps, Midnight Express is going to suffer another loss here this week. Oh, he fights back, showing incredible resilience now. 
Oh, lovely move there by Dennis Condry. Absolutely rocking down Bobby Fulton. As Tommy Rogers in control of Bobby Eaton on the outside. There's the pin. And I don't quite know what happened there. It looks like he tried to break it, but I think he might have missed him. Nice dragon screw still working on the knee. The Fantastics here looking fantastic. Like I said, really um, doing well to work on those legs and also um, weaken those legs potentially for a another figure four. But there's the big leg drop by beautiful Bobby Eaton. That could be game set match if Dennis Condry can keep Bobby Fulton under control. And he can And the Midnight Express pick up the victory against the Fantastics. And what was a very, very good tag team match i really enjoyed that and my word did the midnight express need that bobby eaton currently on minus four finally moves up to minus three and uh old dennis where's dennis den boy dennis dennis mr condry and there he is dennis condry he gets himself up to minus one and then the tag team rankings uh, I have added the Fantastics in to the tag team rankings. They are going to drop down to a minus one. Whereas the Midnight Express, who are a minus three after seven matches, now move up to minus two after eight matches. Still not great, but Dennis Condry proved himself somewhat here today. But I feel like it's Stan Lane's opportunity tomorrow to show what he can do. And that's exactly what we are going to see. Hopefully you've enjoyed that one. If you have, hit the like, subscribe, or leave a good stuff. And once again, thank you very much to Omega Project for coming up with these matches. Uh, there might be a couple of extras if I get time. I might put in there uh, um, just some stuff that PJ Tovey suggested as well. But um, yeah, if you're enjoying this, give some love to Omega Project down below. Um, good night. God bless. I'll be the same. I'll see you all next time. Bye bye. We've got a match coming up tonight, by the way. We've got Sting versus Ric Flair coming up pretty soon. That was suggested by Omega, but also suggested by somebody else in Discord. I'll figure it out. And I'll give them a shout out at the time as well. Good night.